This is the first episode of Entertainment For You. I'm Delilah. And I'm Sophia, and we're gonna cover the drama of the It Ends With Us movie. It Ends With Us is a movie adaptation of Colleen Hoover's book, It Ends With Us, starring Blake Lively and Justin Baldoni. It Ends With Us, Blake Lively's character, Lily Blooms, is chasing her dream to become a flower business owner. She meets a neurosurgeon called Weil, and they start a intense relationship. Over time, she realizes that this relationship is abusive and needs to get out, but can't find a way. Over the summer, there was a lot of excitement about the movie because, you know, the book by Colleen Hoover was a very, was very, um, I wouldn't say controversial, but I would say very popular on TikTok. Um, a lot of people liked it, a lot of people didn't like it, but, but then a lot of people didn't like the cast choice for this um, movie. Can you see the premiere? Blake Lively and Justin Baldoni were not walking together on the red carpet. They were walking with a significant other, which caused a lot of controversy on multiple platforms. So then at the um, red carpet for the premiere of the movie, there were a lot of interviewers obviously asking Blake about Justin because there was no one, there were no cameras to be seen with them together. And she would always ignore the topic. She would always move on to something else, such as her hair care line, Blake and Brown. Never Blake Lively, we get the topic about domestic violence, which is the main theme of the movie. She would always just skip over it and act like it's, it's a light and fun movie and talk about her hair care line. While Justin Baldoni talks about it like a serious thing, as most people should. Which is very interesting because typically women would respond differently to that than men. So obviously the relationship between these two girls first had a lot of controversy because people didn't know what was going on between Lake, Lake Lively and Justin Maldoni. Um, they didn't know if Ryan Reynolds was working behind the scenes. That Justin didn't like because not only is Justin Maldoni one of the co-stars, he is the director of the movie. So he directs what goes on. Not only does it seem that Blake Lively is the only one against Justin Baldoni, it's Colleen Hoover too, who's the writer of the book and I believe works behind the scenes of the movie too. Because, um, so actually Blake Lively and Colleen Hoover did more press together than Justin Baldoni and Blake Lively. And then they did advertisements in the movie, even though Colleen Hoover wasn't in the movie, but she had something to do with the story, obviously. So obviously the relationship between these two co-stars had a lot of controversy because not only did it seem that Blake Lively was the only one against Justin Baldoni, it, it was the entire cast and Colleen Hoover, the writer of the book. Because Blake and Colleen were doing press together, they were doing advertisement for the movies together, making it seem like it was this bright movie, even though obviously as my friend said, it's obviously not a light movie, it's a heavy topic about women and their social rights and how they should be treated by men. And they then came out with a collab at Target with It Starts With Beautiful Nails, which in my opinion is a very, very disrespectful um, thing to come up with, coming from the author of the book. Overall, this movie is not taken lightly and it's a very dark subject and should be taken seriously by everyone. And obviously, there's a lot of drama between the cast and the co-stars. For entertainment for you, please like and subscribe for next week's content. Bye, Bye. guys!